Loveland's Living Planet Aquarium features more than 4,000 creatures living on both land and sea and represents more than 450 species. The aquarium recently moved to Draper from its previous location in Sandy. The move brought in bigger premises and more animals. There are four main exhibits to explore on the Living Planet Aquarium which are Discover Utah, Ocean Explorer, Journey to South America, and the Antarctica Adventure, which houses the penguins in the Falkland Island Research Station. Discover Utah houses many different creatures found right here in our own backyard, including the desert tortoise. And these tortoises are endangered. They come from the St. George area. And so uh, apparently they're making a little bit of a comeback now. But we're lucky to have one. Walter was rescued. He's just four years old. It's three times that big. Otters are the main sight to see here, and they will do anything for a tree. Otters at one point were found quite commonly here in Utah but have since disappeared due to habitat degradation, pollution, and unregulated trapping. They are now protected under the Utah Wildlife Code, and Discover Utah has several of them. Diving to the bottom of the ocean, you'll find the aquarium's main attraction, which is, of course, the 40-foot-long shark tunnel, which features seven breeds of sharks, stingrays, and even a sea turtle, along with other smaller fish. The tunnel weighs 26,000 pounds and is made out of three and a half inches of acrylic glass. Taking a trip south of the border will lead you to exotic creatures not usually found in the United States. Alright, so we are in the Journey to South American unit. We have a lot of different insects on this side. Through here we have the river giants. They're the biggest freshwater fish that you will find in the Amazon. And throughout you'll also find uh, different kinds of turtles, Anamata turtles, and our anaconda peaches. She is 14 and a half feet long and 136 pounds. We also have the white-faced whistling ducks, different uh, freshwater stingrays, and upstairs we have the aviary where we have different kinds of exotic birds, and today you can even see scarlet, uh, scarlet macaw. Upstairs in Journey to South America you'll find a parrot, a toucan, and even a giant rope bridge. All the way down at the South Pole is the Antarctica Adventure Exhibit, which features the Gentoo penguins of the aquarium. Which, for an added price, you can have a full experience with them and even get to feed them and pet them and get a hands-on lesson on their environment. There are 11 of these penguins here for visitors to observe in their natural environment where they splash and dive underwater. Although they are often considered flightless birds as far as the sky goes, the same cannot be said when they get underwater. Loveland's Living Planet Aquarium is still a bit of a work in progress, but judging by how many people crowd the hallways, the staff will have no problem expanding in the future for the years to come.